This is the 1st of December 2021 with Vincent Corporation and at times we have uh, to severely reduce the compression of a screw in order to uh, prevent jamming of material. As you can see the screw has single flighted along the entrance way and each stage of compression has two flights. One, two, one, two, so it's double flighted. We do something called the sterile butterfly cut. And when we do that, we start with a feeder section and look at where the flighting goes. It comes around here. If it will continue, so it go to this flight. So we cut that flight off. That would leave us with this other flight, which comes around here. It will be left on the shaft. If it were continuous, so it would go to this flight. So we cut off this flight. That would leave us with this flight. If it were continuous, it would come around and go here, so we cut off that flight. That would leave us with this flight, which comes around. If it were continuous, it would run into this flight, so we cut off that flight. If this one, no, and that leaves us with this one. So if this flight is left, it comes around, it ends over here. If it were continuous, it would come from here up to here. So we cut off that flight. Oops, we're at the fifth stage of compression. You're better off at the fifth stage. Don't cut off this flight like I just said. Instead, cut it down to about 90 degrees. Cut off a piece here and a piece here. Cut off a piece here, similarly on the other side. Then if you look at the screw, it looks like a butterfly. you got a wing here and a wing here on a butterfly. So that is why it's called the butterfly, and it's called Sterile because it was developed by a company called Sterile Technologies who were pressing glass vials. So they were pressing crushed glass, which tended to jam. By doing the sterile cut, they stopped their jamming and had a successful press. I should have mentioned this early, if you're cutting off a flight, like uh, we were cutting, if we were cutting off this flight, you have a heavy weld right here, I would cut it off, you can cut it off uh, three millimeters, something like that, over above the weld. It'll leave a ridge down here, but uh, that way you're not disturbing the metallurgy. It's easier to get your angle grinder in there to just cut that flight off. We're at Benson Corporation in Tampa. It's the 24th of March. This is the press we're going to uh, try one more time. Notice a very unusual sterile butterfly screw here. Compare it to a standard screw and you can see how we have removed a lot of the flight. There's the standard, and here's what we have on the sterile butterfly.